Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today I will show you how to crochet this Snow White scrunchies. If you want to see more crocheting tutorial, please subscribe and turn on notification. Now let's begin. Firstly, we need a basic hair tie. Then we will need our blue yarn and work 60 single stitches. You can change the number here depends on the size of your hair tie. Now we finished our 60 single stitches. We will then join the round with a slip stitch. Then we will work one chain to secure the end and cut off the yarn. Now we will change it to yellow yarn and create a slip knot. We will then join the main part and chain 3. Then we will work 3 double crochets in the same space. Please be aware, here we are working slightly modified double crochets, which are longer than normal double crochets. Now we finished our first 3 double crochets, we will then find the next space and work another 3 double crochets. We will repeat this process until the end. Now we come to the end of this round. Finally, we will join the round with a slip stitch. Then we will work one chain to secure the end and cut off the yarn. Now we will change to white yarn to work our lace. To do this, we will firstly make a slip knot, and then we will join the main part at any position. And 
now we will chain three in this position. Then we will find the next space from the hook, and then work one single stitch. Please also remember to head all the tails. Then we will chain three again. We will repeat this process until the end. Now we finished this round, we will join the round with a slip stitch and then work one chain to secure the end and cut off yarn. Finally, we will work our bow knot using red yarn. To do this, we will firstly make a slip knot and then chain 13. Please be aware, our first slip knot is not a chain. Then we will find the second chain from the hook and what one single stitch. In each space on this row, we will work one single stitch. By end of this row, we will have 12 single stitch. Now we finished this row, we will then chain 1 as the head of next row and turn around. We will then work one single stitch in the current space. This will be our first single stitch of this row. 
we will work one single stitch in each space. By end of this row, we will still have 12 single stitches. We will repeat this process to work 10 rows in total. Now we come to the end of this piece. We will finish our last single stitch and work one chain to secure the end and cut off yarn. Finally, we will assemble the piece into a bow note, attach it to the main part, and done!